Hi guys, Vex here, and hopefully, as you can hear, uh, my throat is healed. I am over my bronchitis that I had. I finished up my regiment of antibiotics that the doctor prescribed to me. And I am so glad I got insurance this year, because uh, had I not, I would have spent out about $400 between the doctor's visit and um, medicine. But uh, since I got uh, insurance, it was it was like 10 bucks for the doctor and then $10 for the medicine. And uh, that's a lot better than $400. Anyway, anyway. Um, so that's the good news. Good news is uh, I'm better. A uh, little bit of bad news. Well, maybe. Eh, okay. Bad news if you liked the series. I've had some technical difficulty with Fallout New Vegas. Uh, I could start a fresh LP of New Vegas. Um, but right now, like that current save file, uh, the mods are... I've got so many mods, and I can't uh, get them... I've basically switched hard, uh, switched hard drives. And now I have the mods. I actually had the foresight to save my actual Fallout New Vegas game folder. Mods and everything. It's like 12 gigabytes, and I saved a copy of it. But even though I have that, I've discovered that it's not that useful because it's, uh, I told somebody that it's like having a deck of cards, and just having the deck of cards isn't enough. I need the deck of cards, and I need all 52 cards in a specific order to be useful to me. Uh, so basically, what's happening is I'm trying to get at New Vegas and load my save file, and the game's constantly crashing on me. Because uh, I have the game installed, and I've got the mods here, but I can't reconfigure them in just that exact way that they need to be to work, and I can't figure it out. But the good news is that uh, New Vegas and uh, The Sims... Now, The Sims ought to be okay. I've got my save files for that, so I can continue The Sims. Uh, if you'd like, if you guys would like me to do so. If you'd like to see Gato try to not be homeless. Uh... But the good news is that the, those series were to kill time while I waited for Minecraft 1.9 to come out. And 1.9's snapshots are getting more and more advanced, and I feel like it's time uh, I can go ahead and start playing the snapshots. I know 1.9 is not out officially yet, but it's pretty close. Uh, so what I'm going to do is go back to the main thing on my channel, which has always been Minecraft, and I'm going to start a Minecraft 1.9 LP. Um, not on the Minecraft server, but solo so that I can have access to MC Edit and other tools. And I can mess with my save world as much as I want to and go into creative, go into not creative, do whatever, put spawn this in. I can't do any of that on the Minecraft server because they want it to be all 100% vanilla. You know, no, no, no anything, no anything extra. Um, that's not what I need for my needs. It doesn't. That's not suitable. And I also just want to go into a brand new, fresh world by myself too. Uh, and I just want to kind of, you know, relax a little bit and experience Minecraft like it's a new game. Because uh, a lot of things have changed. So you might be asking, well, what are you going to do once you've gotten used to 1.9? Well, the reason I'm going to go in and play 1.9, not only for the enjoyment of just playing Minecraft again, uh, just solo Minecraft LP like I used to back in the old days, but I also have to get... Uh, I, I'm, I'm starting from scratch, wiping the slate clean. Like I said, I do have a new hard drive. Um, and that means that... Uh, Obviously, my super hostile stuff and then my maps are backed up in the cloud because I'm not an idiot. And they're backed up on other portable hard drives, too. But uh, I don't happen to have all my schematics with me. I don't happen to have all my maps on this specific computer here. Uh, and they're safe in the cloud, tucked away. Don't worry about that. But uh, I kind of don't want them. I want to start completely fresh. And I would like to reboot the Super Hostile series. 
for Minecraft 1.9 because there are so many new changes. It's uh, I've tried a little bit already uh, on a previous snapshot build of 1.9. The combat is completely different. You cannot spam click anymore. Uh, the combat is and, and bows. If the enemy has a shield, uh, bows are not necessarily gonna just. Oh, I've got a bow now. Who can, who needs swords? I'm just gonna shoot everything to death. <laughs> Skeletons are pretty evil. Uh, I love that change. Skeletons, well, they're not evil. They're just they behave more like a player with a bow. They so they behave more naturally. Like because previously it was uh, players and player bow mechanics over on, you know, over here. And then uh, over there you had skeletons and skeleton bow mechanics, and they were two different things. Um, the skeleton changes recently have kind of merged them a bit. I mean, they're not the exact same, obviously, but they, uh, to the to the player that can't see the game's code, they appear, you know, to be the same. Uh, so I want to play Minecraft 1.9 get a feel for the game, just enjoy it and have fun with it too. Uh, but after I get a feel for the game, I want to start making some dungeons. Maybe link the dungeons together. There might be some wool involved. You know. Or maybe not. Hell, I don't know. Maybe I should... Maybe I'll make a completely different uh, goal. You know? Because Super Hostile started as survival maps. Like, you just, oh, here's a here's a world, a custom world. Just survive in it. And then in Kaizo Caverns, uh, my fourth map, I introduced the Victory Monument system. And I invented the CTM genre. Um, one magazine, though, reported that I helped popularize it. Which is technically right. I did certainly help popularize it. But I also... It would have been nice if I had gotten, you know, credit for inventing the damn thing. <clears throat> but whatever. Um, so this will be a new series. So the first Super Hostile series, I don't like. I've got plenty of numbers left, but the mechanics are changing. The game has changed so much that I, I, I want to start over. So this will be, you know, something, something number one. Uh, so I'll need a new name for a series. Um, I might just steal what Nintendo did and call it New Super Hostile. Because that's... That's what it is. It's in... It's in... in NSH. New Super Hostile. And that's a, that's a short abbreviation. It's right to the point. Um, I had... I took suggestions from people. And... Uh, it's still kind of difficult to pin down a name, I'd say. Uh, but I'd like to reboot the Super Hostile series and begin making fresh maps. And I'm really looking forward to the changes that I know about so far in 1.9. I'd really like to not have to spam monsters at people like I did in uh, Inferno Mines. The last areas of Inferno Mines, I had to spam monsters because the players get so powerful. And... I'd like to keep the system that I was working on, at least I'm leaning towards it anyway, of uh, the two absorption hearts above your health part as a shield, but also not having uh, food health regeneration. By eating enough food, you don't regenerate. So, no natural health regeneration. But you do get the regenerating little shield bar, you know. It's like a Halo-style shield system over your non-regenerating HP. Halo 1 and the next Halos, they got rid of that. Um, so basically a Halo 1-style uh, HP system. That's what I'm leaning towards right now. Uh, if you have any, if you have any suggestions or requests, most definitely stick them down in the comment section. Uh, I will be paying special attention to the comment section of this video. So if you have anything uh, you want to ask about or suggest, uh, stick it in there. And I'll try my best to answer people's. If the comment section balloons over like a thousand comments, uh, then, you know, 
I might not be able to respond to everybody, but I'll I'll try my best. Uh, <clears throat> just keep in mind that the the bigger the comment section, the harder it'll be for me to respond to people, individual people. But I will read everything. Uh, so if you have any suggestions or requests, let me know. Uh, and um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Hmm. That's about it. And uh, I'm really, really looking forward to getting back to my roots and working on Minecraft. It, the Minecraft, Minecraft. Uh, I'm really happy with the 1.9 update from what I've seen in the snapshot so far. The game was getting kind of stale, especially as far as the gameplay was concerned. Uh, building was fine. Exploring was all right. But the the combat was kind of eh. um, it was like spam clicking swords and you shoot your bow at stuff and as long as you got enough arrows bow is like the always the best weapon pretty much um, somebody's gonna contradict me on that but uh, especially with a uh, no HP regen like the bows like the, just you shoot like if you can shoot something do it you know don't just run up and risk melee with like a, a zombie or a cave spider you know or, or a skeleton yeah I mean when you're facing skeletons creepers and cave spiders you 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 you, you dumb if you pulling out a sword and running into that crap you shoot them with a bow um, but anyway that's it I'll wrap this up uh, leave me your suggestions leave me your comments leave me your requests and I'm back in business. Bye.